This is a Bucks Fast Break presented by West Bend. The silver lining, a 129-118 victory for the Milwaukee Bucks against the shorthanded Golden State Warriors. No Steph Curry for Golden State here on a Saturday night, so the Bucks take advantage. Big three combined for 84 points, but Andre Jackson, uh, the young rookie, what a, what a significant role he played on both ends of the floor in the second half of, of what was a close game and the Bucks were able to pull away. Yeah, and he really has been just such a meaningful spark. Obviously, the big three playing well also, but for Ajax to come in and to play the minutes that he played late into the fourth quarter when the game was on the line, to be making plays like this energy plays, extra efforts, it really is meaningful, and I think you've seen this starting group really respond. He's unselfish. He's always looking for others to score, and so it's no surprise that this is his first career double-double. Ten points, ten rebounds, because the rebounds I would have almost expected to come before the ten points. He's always assisting and screening, and he's on the floor first. But those kind of plays right there, this whole team was feeding off a big-time block right there. Everybody in the arena loved it. Great energy effort by him. And like I was saying, it was not just him out there tonight. Yeah, the big three combined for 84, as I mentioned. Giannis, 33 to lead the way. Uh, Dame Lillard had a big first half, also 11 more in the third quarter for 27. And then Chris Middleton, 24 and 10 assists as well. He really uh, paced the Bucks attack in that second half, especially in that fourth quarter when Milwaukee scored 46 points. Here's head coach Adrian Griffin on Chris Middleton. You know, Chris is Chris. That's what he does, you know, especially in the fourth quarter. Um, he gets a rhythm and he gets going and uh, I thought he was, uh, you know, having him on the floor as a, a general, you know, and he's calling plays, he's getting us in the right spot, uh, made some big time shots. So, uh, I, you know, Chris was f- uh, phenomenal tonight. Uh, Giannis was phenomenal. Um, Dane was great. I thought we played some really good basketball. Yep, they uh, certainly did finish up strong. So the second of back-to-back Sunday night against De'Aaron Fox and the Sacramento Kings were on the air at 5.30 for that one. Uh, Kings are a team, boy. you got to be ready to go. They're having a fine season. You do have to be ready to go. This is an explosive offensive team. It's not just De'Aaron Fox averaging almost 28 points per game for his team, leading the way on the offensive end. But Sabonis, the leading rebounder in the entire NBA, at almost 13 rebounds a game. He's also putting up 20 points. And so... This is a very good Sacramento team. It'll be a tough game for Milwaukee, but obviously at home, be a great one if they can pull it out. Yeah, they're trying to close out the home stand uh, strong by winning a third straight. Again, we're on the air at 530 for that one. This has been a Bucks Fast Break presented by West Bend, the Silver Line.